Henry Johnson is perhaps one of the most remarkable black military heroes in U.S. history. And he found himself in no man's land with Private Needham Roberts manning a listening post. And Needham Roberts hears click, click, click. And he realizes somebody's cutting the wire. It's potentially a German raid. And so Roberts is passing him grenades and they line up these grenades and the Germans actually do come across the lines. Roberts is hurt and now Henry Johnson is left to defend their position and to stave off this attack. And then he makes the mistake of jamming a French cartridge into his American gun and it no longer will work. And the Germans are on top of it. He then used his rifle like a club and then he ended up fighting with a knife against the Kaiser's best and turned them. He's wounded in the fray. He's struck, for example, in the foot um, and has a debilitating injury as a result. And he fights them off, he says, for what seemed like an hour. The Germans ran shrieking into the night, all because of one man. It's not until the next morning that people realize what a tremendous act this was. They discover four bodies of dead German soldiers. And they also realize from the equipment and other things that are left behind that as many as 30 may have been involved in this altercation. As soon as he drove off those Germans, the French awarded him with the Croix de Guerre, a great honor. Unfortunately, it took about 75 years for the U.S. government to give him the Legion of Merit. Had he been white, he would have walked out of that war with the Medal of Honor.